good looking ball through and it's in Andy Roberts scores Palace are in front and Kevin Paul won't believe that at Wembley a ball could bubble over him from that some all culminating in some good play between Houghton and Roberts Roberts brings the ball out from the back to start with by Kevin Poole. That for me is the best bit of football there's been, uh, Alan. Good little link-up play, and here you see, hardly gets a look at goal, he's hooking that all the way to goal, and that's a great save. Is it? Walsh. As it's continued his run down the left, and Walsh, with a glorious ball, sets him clear. That could be a penalty, it is! They're celebrating already, but there's a rather important kick to come yet. But a brilliant ball by the captain Walsh. And Muzzy is it. Determined, was tripped by Edworthy. The referee had no hesitation. Gary Parker, never afraid to take responsibility, will take the kick. I don't think anyone, Alan, can begrudge them that. They've worked, they've drove, they've fought, and they've got the reward for it. And it's a safe bet the calmest man on the field there would have been Gary Parker. Absolutely. He was always first in the queue, I think, for Villa when yes. the European penalties were taken. Always, always will take responsibility, on no matter how his game is, he's the sort of player that will never shirk anything. A minute and a half of added time, and that's it. In fact, the referee calls a halt. The 90 minutes has finished all square. Now, I'm not sure what's happening here, because Zelko Kalats, the substitute goalkeeper, is coming on to take Kevin Poole's place. And obviously, something, some conversations has gone on on the bench there, I would think. And maybe Kalats says, look, I am the king when it comes to penalty shootouts. You get me on there, and I'll win you this match. It's the only thing I can imagine that's happened. Well, he's a big lad, and whether that they think he fills the goals, you know, when it looks a bit more intimidating when penalties are being taken. Um, I'm surprised that, because Paul's always given the impression that he's an excellent uh, reaction keeper. Well, but that could be the winner from Claridge. It is! a replica of the Cantona goal isn't it in the cup final away he's composed himself and hit it great strike great timing and as you so rightly said what a great substitution I can't help thinking that the delay when the substitute was made because we were confused whether the referee had blown for time he has now. It is now it's all over and Leicester City take their place in the Premiership and there is not a shadow of a doubt that they deserve it it was a cruel, cruel way for Nigel Martin and Crystal Palace to lose out in the end when they must have felt they were going to at least have an opportunity from the penalty spot. Michael Alcock, the managing director of Ensley Insurance, hands over the trophy and listen to this noise. <laughs>